Former professional surfer Chris Davidson has died after a violent night out in Australia, according to police, who spoke to The Guardian, the 45-year-old athlete was punched outside a pub on September 24 before he fell and hit his head on the pavement. Officers found him unconscious on the ground before taking him to Kempsey Hospital, where he died a short time later. According to the publication, police arrested a 42-year-old man in Southwest Rocks, New South Wales and charged him with assault causing death. He was refused bail in court on September 25. Stay informed about local news and weather during the hurricane season. Get the NBC6 South Florida app for iOS or Android and pick your alerts. Surfing Australia, a non-profit organization overseeing surfing in Australia, also confirmed Davidson's death. Davo was an incredibly talented surfer and a true individual in our sport and community, Surfing Australia shared on Facebook September 25th. Our thoughts go out to his two children, friends and family at this time. Celebrity Deaths, 2022's Fallen Star. Soon after his death was confirmed, many in the surfing community posted tributes online. In a screenshot captured by Seven News, Kelly Slater wrote a message on his Instagram story that read, Lost another soldier yesterday. Had many a good battle with this guy. One of the most naturally talented surfers I ever knew. Fellow surfer Nathan Hedge told the Today Show in Australia that his close friend was robbed too early. It's just the worst thing ever, Nathan said. Not only has Chris been taken from us, the other person's life is shattered and ruined as well. Nothing positive can come out of this. It's the worst thing in the world. He continued, he had so much more life to give, enjoy and cherish. I will miss his practical jokes, and I just miss his passion. He was always up for anything and I will miss his hugs. His motto was, make it mean something. He had that passion in the water and in other areas of his life as well.